Hello internet people that are probably smarter than me. Today we are going through GameCube and Wii de decompilation, specifically doll disassembly through uh, the program Datosan. This video is meant as a drop-in replacement for this one by Got7. If you're having issues with uh, doll disassembly.py or just want to skip some of the manual steps that come with it, Datosan actually covers about 80% of the manual steps in that video. It is quite nice. Let's go ahead and skip to this timestamp to get to the tutorial. The next couple minutes are just going to be explaining some things and a few disclaimers and context and all that fun stuff. I won't be covering Ghidra and ELF files. Go ahead and check out Gata 7s video if you're working with an ISO with debug symbols, which you probably should if you're watching this tutorial. I'm not, but that is because I like suffering. Credit to Unusual Z for Datosod, the beautiful person. You'll want to download the latest version from the link in the description, as well as Dolphin. While you do that, um, this video is up to date as of May 2023. If it is significantly later than that, you may want to find a newer tutorial. Hopefully it exists. If not, hopefully this one works. I'll be working in Windows 10 with Dolphin 5 and Datosod 1.0.1, disassembling the main.doll file from the Mario Sunshine copy in the footage shown on screen right now to cover my ass. I bought this game a second time just to be able to toy with it how I choose, and that includes teaching y'all. Last thing, I am not an expert, I am just a person that had trouble with a two-year-old tutorial and wanted to share this information that I couldn't find in a digestible format. Massive credit to Gata7 and all the devs of the programs mentioned in this video. Like all programmers, I am standing on the shoulders of giants, and proudly so. Alright, so right now we're just going to cover getting from your uh, ISO that you legally acquired, and having that extracted, and getting your boot.doll or main.doll in alongside uh, datasod.exe. If you already have your uh, ISO extracted, you can go ahead and skip to the timestamp in on the screen now. If not, you're going to go to our ISO file in Dolphin, right click, go into Properties, scroll all the way to the right, go to File System, right click, and this is different from the previous uh, video by got 7 um, that is because Dolphin updated. Um, instead of just extracting doll, we are going to extract entire disk, which will include the doll. And then we're going to go on over to whichever folder. Select that. And go ahead and extract that folder. Alright, once you have that extracted, you're going to want to navigate over to that folder. Drag and drop your datasod.exe into your sys folder. Once you have that exe in with your sys folder, you're going to want to press Windows and R, type in CMD, it's already preloaded for me. Um, for you, your file might be on the same drive. For me, I'm going to have to navigate to F, and take this folder, copy it, go back, type cd space quote, paste in your file path, and type another quote. These are both double quotes, and you'll be navigated to this folder. From here, you will want to type datosod.exe space doll with one L space main.doll again with one L. You may have a boot.doll, in which case you'll be typing boot.doll here. And just go ahead and run that. This will cover most of the actual steps from that video previously mentioned. Um, it will separate your files for you and also write your macros.s for you. And now you're ready to reassemble your doll file with Gata 7's third video in the description below. That was so much easier than uh, doll disassembly.py.
Thank you so much, and you shall see again, and all the uh, contributors on screen right now. If you have trouble with this tutorial, uh, go ahead and try uh, Gata 7's tutorial for this same thing. Um, it might work better for you, perhaps uh, doll disassembly.py is more updated at this time than uh, Datosot is. Um, if you're still having issues, uh, he is definitely more equipped to help you than I am. Anyway, uh, thank you for watching, and uh, good luck. Good luck with whatever you're doing. Whatever horrible, painful things you're doing.